Morning. I'll let you get out of the way. <laughs> no, I don't wanna, I might hit you. <laughs> I'm out here again with the Traxxas Bandit BXL. I did not have time to completely fix this wing. Freaking figures, I hit a rock down there at the end of the road and just shattered the front wing. But I used some liquid nails and some Gorilla Glue and some Super Glue and pieced this thing back together. And I think it should hold together as long as I don't hit anything else today. Same setup, stock Bolinian motor, hobby wing, 120 amp ESC, and I'm running a 27 tooth pinion gear along with a 48 tooth Kimbro spur gear. Last time out here, I determined this SMC 3S 6500 Ma 150C LiPo was my fastest battery. However, I don't know if I ever gave this Lupiri Air 6200 Ma 3S LiPo a fair shake. I always thought the 6000 was a little quicker but looking back at some of my older videos, I really didn't run them that much. And uh, I'm gonna give this one a run. So last time out here, this hit 78 miles an hour. The Lapiri Air hit 77 miles an hour. So it was about a little less than one mile an hour slower. So we'll give this one a shake and see how it does. Today is a little more windy. Um, so that may play into the speeds overall, but we'll just compare them today's speeds to one another. One other thing to keep in mind with these LiPos is the price. The SMC is $60, which is an excellent price for a battery with this kind of performance. However, these Lapiri Air batteries tend to be cheaper. These have even stronger value, be it maybe slightly lower performance. Um, this one here retails, I think it's like 52 or 53. The Lapiri Air 6000 I tested yesterday was, uh, I think $35. So at any rate, I'm gonna go ahead and get started and we'll see what kind of speeds we can put down today with the Bandit. Okay, the GPS is zeroed out and reading. Wind is making it a little challenging today for sure. It's a bit of a crosswind. Okay, I'm gonna do three runs with each battery. Again, this is the SMC, 79.3. So we have a bit of a crosswind today and a bit of a um, tailwind as well. So next up is gonna be the Lapiri Air 6200 mod. Well, it's been quite a while since I've run this battery in the Bandit. And one thing I forgot is this one actually fits in the battery compartment. The other Lapiri does not, the 6000, it's uh, a little too wide. All right, I have the GPS zeroed out and let's see what kind of performance we can get here. Oh, well, there's somebody walking down the road, so I might as well check the speed. I need to let them pass before I uh, come ripping by them. 77.9 on the first run. Morning. I'll let you get out of the way. <laughs> no, I don't wanna, I might hit you. <laughs> Okay, the previous best again was 77.9. Got my two more runs in here. And 
77.3. So yeah, the 6000 is a faster battery than the 6200 Lapierre, Le and it's about it's over one mile an hour slower than the SMC. Still one of my strongest batteries. Um, my lower performance batteries with this setup would be in the low 70 mile an hour range. So not a bad performance, just not quite at the level as the SMC. Now I'm gonna go ahead and test the pre-production batteries. I cannot show these on camera, but I can assure you that the GPS is zeroed out and uh, we'll see how they perform. I can't go into specifics on them. All I can tell you is if they perform better or worse than the uh, other batteries I've tested today. All right, let's see what I can do. I'm gonna check the speed just cause I'm really interested and the sun came out and need to get some sunglasses on anyway. This was just as fast as the SMC. All right, on those last two runs, it lost 1.1 miles an hour. Still a very strong performance. The second pre-production pack is in here, and the GPS is zeroed out. The first run was 76.8 and on the second and third runs the fastest speed was 76.3 all right now i have the smc in here get this thing hooked up and ready to go Seventy-seven point five was the fastest. All right, it looks like that was indeed five runs. So now let's go ahead and do the sixth and see what kind of speeds we're getting. All right, that solidifies this SMC as the fastest of 13 different 3S LiPos I've tested. This thing is an absolute monster and it sells for $60 plus shipping. So really strong value for the kind of performance you're getting in this battery. I've done other testing. I'll put a link below in the uh, video description where this actually ran more than twice as long as uh, some of the lower performing batteries because they had so much voltage sag. The voltage dipped down and hit the low voltage cutoff of the uh, Arbor Big Rock I was running it in, in uh, grass. And uh, so this not only is faster, but it also ran twice as long. So, you know, it's twice as expensive, maybe a little less than twice as expensive, but you can get twice as long run times and much improved performance over a lower end battery. Now these Lapiri Air batteries, these are all really strong performers as well. When I say a low performance battery, I'm not talking about these. Uh, in the Bandit with this setup, a low performance battery will struggle to do 70 miles an hour, where this is in the high 70 mile an hour range. So that's the difference. 
Um, the Lapiri Air battery, the 6200, is not quite as fast as their 6000 battery. This one retails, I think it's $53, whereas the 6000 retails for, I think it's $36 or $7 right now. So for speed runs, that one would be my pick. But you can't go wrong with either of these. SMC is definitely the speed champ, however. And uh, the pre-production batteries I tested, one of them was equal to the SMC on the first run. Last time out, it was slightly quicker. And then after eight speed runs in a row, the SMC held its speed better. So awesome battery here. This thing after a total of, I guess it was nine speed runs, was still going 74 miles an hour. I think it had gone well over two miles at that point. Um, so yeah, a monster. The Bandit, it held up really well. Uh, after doing five speed runs in a row, the motor was getting pretty hot. I could only hold my finger on it for about five or six seconds. So I let it cool a bit. But um, when I say five or six speed runs, that's five or six loops. Uh, so quite a bit of running with this setup and it was rock solid, no issues. The wing worked as it should. And uh, yeah, I'll get out here again and start picking the speeds up again, but solid runs today. And I hope you guys found the information useful on these batteries. That's all I have for now. Please like and subscribe and I'll see you guys on the next one.